guys, welcome back. Um, so yeah, I did my hair. Well, my cousin did my hair. Anyway, so this is what it turned out. I absolutely love it. Um, as you can see, beautiful colours. So yeah, we did use Arctic Fox, and it was well. This turned out really, really great. Um, tomorrow I will be receiving an item that is supposed to help with hair growth, volume of hair, and help thicken it up, and like the damage of it. So I kind of need to do that. Um, while I am here, I'm going to be giving myself a trim because Lord don't know these ends need it, <laughs> and I like, want to try and see if I can put my fringe back in because like <laughs> this is hell long. So I'm going to be doing that today. I do have my brush. I have. Why the hell is that one? Anyway, I have my hair dye comb. I couldn't find my normal caramel I use, so I was just like, yeah, I'll just use this one. So my hair dye comb. I have skeezers because, like, why not? And I also have a razor. Now, I don't, I've done this before and it did look really good, but like, yeah, <laughs> so I will be trying to do it again. I will be using what, my camera, camera? Yeah. my camera, my, my, my camera is my mirror because like, I don't have a mirror in my room. And I have no space for said mirror, as like my walls are taken up with lovely displays. So anyway, and I um, so I will be doing that, and you can watch me make a mess of myself. Well, my hair. In fact, so first off, I'm just gonna part in it. So like, see how it's like really sketchy at you here. Well, not like half over here, half here. I want a lot of it. So I want this side parting right here. So I'm just gonna get my brush, click that over, do this. I need to get some actual proper combs for this. You know, the ones that you can actually get, I don't even know what they're called. The ones that you can actually see like get right so you can actually get a proper part in. I need to get one of them. I need to invest in one of them. So I will be looking into it there. So alright, after I've done that, I give this a quick brush out. Look at all those lovely colours. <laughs> Ignore me. Um Yeah. So that is okay. Then I will be taking my comb and I'm just gonna check that the lining's right on my hair. So like, see here where this orange is? I need to, obviously, whip that bad boy over like that. And like, I need to point it, I need to point it. I mean, I could try and use the scissors, I guess. But, you know what? I'd rather not injure myself, so I'm gonna go the safe option. <laughs> so, that is that. Um, like, it's difficult with fresh dye on as well. Like, I'm not even kidding, because like, you can't fully see it. Anyway, so it's a pain in the arse. So you can kind of see my fringe right here. So you can see where it needs cutting. So, fun times. So, 
there we go i do recommend not to do this at home like go and get it professionally like even just a trim go to a salon or a hairdresser's whether you be here from the uk or america or whatever country make sure you see a specialist i'm only doing it because i really can't be asked to go and spend like 50 quid to just get it trimmed and for them to put my friends back in so i'm gonna do it myself and i can estimate exactly how much i want because like, i don't want to take see when you go to the hairdressers and they put it in they'll take like that much off and i'll be like oh yeah that's just a trim well that's what i find anyway the past few i've gone i've like took that like loads off and i'm like yeah it's just a trim that's just a trim i'm like that's not a trim i want you like that much off so i can estimate and work out and as well like by not I can kind of give myself a couple of layers, like not drastic, but like little ones with cutting like small amounts off. Because like this is better probably show. You. Like if you see here, like you've got a, I've got this short piece here, so but I'm I want to leave that to grow. But anyway, like some lengths are like nice and short, some are long, and I do like that. So I'm just gonna give it a quick trim, take the dead off, and. Yeah, because I it's practically fried anyway. And I'm gonna go from there. So yeah, I'm just gonna go try the scissors first. So <laughs> like I've seen so many, many people do this as well. Like ah! like trim the hair at home and it's got complete fail. Like I was watching this video earlier and like she dyed it. She dyed it in this colour and it didn't take no she bleached it it didn't take well to her hair or anything and like it just it, yeah she just it, it was not a pretty process she she bleached it and like the bleach didn't go well she didn't bleach it correctly and it just went to shit she then put the color on the color was patchy as fuck and the yeah it was just not a proud moment so obviously i'm literally not even taking a lot off My scissors are crap, like they're not even really good scissors either. But yeah. There we go. So that looks a lot neater than scraggly ends. But I will go back in with the razor and just clean it up. But for now, I am just using the scissors. These are really bad scissors. So. Yeah. And again, I'm just like. Not even. Taking. A lot off, so like, just where it needs it, really. Cause like, I want, I do want my hair to stay like at this length, cause I do like this length. And as it says, I like. Well, I don't know if I've said. What did I say? Anyway, I am wanting to have it grow out a bit. Because I do miss the length. But I also think it's healthy to get this trimmed. So that, that is what I'm doing, as you can see. So... Voila. I've actually cut them pretty well. 
So, yeah. So we're on to my last section. I should have got my clips as well, but oh well. Oh well, it's done now. Nearly finished with the scissors. And then I'm just gonna go back in and chat with the razor and then gonna put a lovely fringe back in. As I said, like, this is no tutorial or anything, so. Yeah. I thought it would be about time to put something on here instead of me just blah 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 like talking every time about stuff I've done so plus this is the more trim needs been doing I did it like way way like back in October when I last trimmed it so it's done pretty good, but I took an excessive amount of it. I took loads. When I mean loads, I mean fucking loads. So. I also know that like, if I ever went to a hair salon, they'd be like, what the fuck have you done to your hair? It's fried, like, shit. So yeah, that's got a bit of a curl, but that's because I took it behind my, hair, my ear a lot because of the length it's at. So now I'm gonna be brushing out and putting my fringe in. Or at least trying to, should I say. Where the fudge did I put my comb? I am working on my bed, by the way, so like, because like, I, my room's not big enough, so, it is. like, yeah. Yeah, you can see, like, the difference in it is major. I leave this bit long? I don't know. Okay, so this bit's fine, really. So I'm gonna push that. I'm just gonna give this a quick trim so that even though, like, Look shit, it looks shit. I ain't forced. It's just her. At the end of the day. So. God, this was so much easier when I had a hair dry. Like, I used to blow dry it beforehand and do this. So I'm just going to take my razor and just try and tidy up a bit.
yeah see like it really needs to be cut yeah ideally i mean that's okay it's just i don't know I think it's just because it's like getting long now, so I'm a bit like, eh. I'm also at a point like, can I be asked to maintain it? Can I really be bothered? See, like how before it was completely draped over this eye and like it was practically blinding me, whereas now it's not. <laughs> Let me take my razor again. I think I just shaved my fucking hair. Shit. Oh well. No, no, we are cool. We are cool beans. So like you probably can't even tell there's been much difference to it. But like it needs washing and styling anyway, so yeah, that's all being put back in. Not majorly, but it's there. It's there. Should've just done this off camera, really. I mean that in itself isn't too bad like if I hold it up in a pony that doesn't look too bad I am quite impressed with that and I like how the fact it just goes into a point but they will just grow back out my head doesn't even take long to grow so that is that so yeah now I'm just gonna go back on these bad boys I'm not even taking loads off, like, you won't even know, you'll probably notice the difference. So. But I find this is a cheaper way for me, especially like right now. But I can't be bothered to go to the salon. And <laughs> the ones like that's closest to me, they're not the best. Either. So, yeah, I'll just do it myself. I mean, my cousin is genuinely a, like, she's trained to be a hairdresser. That's who did my hair. And um, I could have asked her to do it yesterday. But I didn't want to pass her and like, any more than I'd already had. So. Like, it's not a major difference, as you can see, but it is there. It is. It's a bit, you know, it is. It is there. You know, I haven't even took loads off. So. Okay, and that is that, guys. Like, please subscribe, like, and share this video. I would like to get my views up. Um, I hope I get more this time. Um, as this fades out, I will be doing hair dye tutorials and hopefully, hopefully be able to video them this time. As it says, I couldn't for this one because my cousin needed it for a competition, blah, blah, blah. But anyway, I was doing this for hair dye purposes and I really want to start giving my opinion out there and my experience of how I get my amazing cuts. Because like, I've been doing it for like, what? Uh, three years in college. Four, 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 four. 
yeah, for like four or five years now, so. And like, I've done my hair, I've done my sister's hair, I've done my mum's hair, my cousin's cousin's hair, my partner's hair, he's hair, he's like So, but yeah, like, I just want to get my experience out there and that, and like, I've never had any issues or anything with it, especially dyeing it. And I I have switched my brands. I've, I now have gone to Arctic Fox, which I love. And I do bleach it myself as well. So, yeah, I thought, you know, yeah, why not? Get my experience out there. Get what I know and hopefully get my teachings and little tips to pass on to you guys. And hopefully try and you will help broaden my horizon and take that knowledge in um so yeah anyway um i should be back with another one soon hopefully this time we might actually be doing something to it like bleaching it or something um or i might just video and let you guys know about the whole process of how this fades out i have not planned that um however i would like to do a dye if you have any suggestions or ideas please say in the comments um i have not yet had anyone comment on my videos but please 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 your feedback would be great and boost up berza says if you really want me to go with color then go ahead i'm at a point now where i'm just like i feel like i'm gonna go this color i'll do it or i'll be like hmm kind of fancy doing this so i'm gonna try it and like everyone's like, oh, why don't you try this? I'm like, yeah, I'll do it. I've done every other color. I've done this color, doing that. I'm like, I'm just literally ready to, to just experiment with it and just do whatever. I am. This is the first time I've ever gone rainbow, and I do like it. Um, I got a hair in my eye. Ah. Death by uh, hair. Still there. Ah! <sighs> right, hang on it. Um. So yeah, if you want me to go with a specific colour, so I have done them all. So if you really would like to see them, and what colour I would go, I've gone reds, blues, purples, blacks, pinks, browns. Well, not brown, because that's permanent. Um, but semis. I will quite happily do. I will not put permanent on my hair at all, but semis I will quite happily do. But if you want me to try different brands, I will, can do as well. I have tried Strasgar, I have tried Manic Panic, I have done Arctic Fox now. I'm also gonna try, I'm also tr gonna try and get another dye brand and see how that works. So if you want to see different stuff, mm, damage my hair even more um then please subscribe like and tune in <laughs> i don't know why i do that like it's so stupid but no like as i says if you want to see more then please subscribe and let me know what you think like i've seen so many videos now so and i'm just like yeah i kind of want to get my experience and what i've been going through now um, but yeah, if you really want me to go a specific colour, I will. The only colour I have not ever gone in my entire, entire experience of dying is yellow. So, bye.